episode 4 of Blue Devil Pride Network. I'm Maria Anderson reporting in front of the DHS Garden on Wednesday, September 29th. Now, here are the Wednesday announcements from Stucka. What's well, poppin' DHS? It's Grace. And it's Ray. And we're here to tell you guys about the weekly Stug Up Scoop. First off, we have the club fair. Today is the last day to go. So during lunch, go ahead and go look at some clubs. Be there! Or be square. Also, check your email to see if you were nominated for homecoming royalty. You have to verify that you will run and respond by the end of Friday or else. You done, will done, not win. Done. And finally, we have a message from the National Honor Society. So, hey, the National Honor Society is registering for this fall semester from Monday, September 27th to Friday, October 8th on the quad during lunch. Bring $5 and your last semester transcript. For returning members, remember your hour sheets from last year. NHS is a student organization that values academic excellence and community service and provides scholarship opportunities for students. So go check it out. Um, I think that's it. What do we you think? We have one more thing. Mr. G, please stop freeze framing on our faces. Thank you. Thanks, Stucka, for that video. Now we have a video from Max Davis Housefield on taking the train to San Francisco. People gather at the historic Davis train station to catch the 510 westbound Amtrak. Students and community members have been taking the train to San Francisco for the day. The Amtrak line lets passengers out at Oakland, where they then have the choice of taking either the ferry or the subway into the city. Gianna Onsioko is a junior at Davis High. She drove with her mother to Concord, then took the subway into San Francisco. I like the route it went. Um, I think it went through some pretty places. She was going to the city to renew her passport at the Philippine consulate. That didn't take that long, so the rest of the time, me and my mom walked around, saw um, the sights, but it was a good excuse to go explore the city for the day. George Hu recently took his family on the train trip. They boarded at the Davis train station and rode the rails all the way to Oakland. Then they took the ferry across San Francisco Bay. It was the kids' first time. It's actually my first time too, going from Oakland to, to the ferry building. It was roomy. I mean, we, we loved the table where you could we'd sit together and we were playing cards. And our little one was looking out the window the whole time. Both Hu and Ong Sioko noticed the COVID safety protocols in place. You have to wear a mask the whole time. And you have to fill out a health safety form where they make sure you didn't, you didn't have any symptoms. Pretty much everyone in there was compliant with it. And then I think people just sat in seats farther away from each other. They both recommend the train as an easy way to get to the city. It's comfortable, it's relaxing, and you don't have to worry about traffic or driving, and so it's, uh, it's, it's a great venture. I really, really recommend it. I would go more often if I didn't have this like, perception that it would be a really long trip because of the car rides back and forth. It's really not when you take the train. For the Blue Devil Hub, I'm Max Davis Housefield. Thanks, Max, for the video. Now, here are the sports scores from this past week. That's all for this week's episode of BDPN. If you would like to submit a one minute video to be in next week's BDPN, send us an email at dhsbdpn at gmail.com. Don't forget to check out the hub page in the enterprise this week. Make sure to follow our Instagram at Blue Devil Hub, our Facebook and our Twitter at DHS Hub, and our website, bluedevilhub.com, to see all of our articles, podcasts, and videos. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week.